Hello guys, welcome to the fourth section of Power BI series. Today we want to talk about merging queries. And when we talk about merging queries, we are talking about joining columns. We shall discuss how to join rows as we continue. So here you can see I have two queries already imported into my Power Query editor. And I want to join the list of orders and the other details into one query. So I will navigate to this right hand side here and click on Merge Queries as New. So once I do that, I will select the next table that I want to merge together, which is the other details. And after doing that, the next thing to do is to select the merging columns. And here, the merging columns are Order ID. And I will select the both for the two table. And here you can see we have different type of joint. I'm going to go ahead and run you through each every one of them. The first one here is left after join. When you perform a left after join on two tables, if there are no matching rows on the left table, they are going to return as no value on the right table. And the same thing goes for the right after join. If there are no matching rows on the right table, they are going to be returned as no values on the left table. And what the full after join does is this is a combination of both the left after join and the right after join so if there are no values on both the right table and the left table they are all going to be returned together then here comes the inner join the inner join will filter the both we filter both table and return only the rules that are matching on these both tables here and the next one is left anti join Power BI has two other joins, which are left anti-join and right anti-join. And this will return only the null values on the left table. And this will return only the right, the null values on the right table. So here, all we can do is we will select the type of join that has a corresponding match between the two tables. And I think is the right outer join. Mm -hmm. And here we can see the selection matches 1,500 of 1,500 rows from the second table. So this is the right join for you to join. It's very easy as that. So all you need to do is go ahead and click this OK button here. And these uh, two queries will be merged into one. So in order for us to see the second table, the values on the second table, we have to expand this. We have to check out the order ID because it was the key in which we used to merge these two tables. Okay. And we click OK, and this table should expand. And here you can see the amount, profit, quantity, category, and sub. They are all merged mm -hmm. to the order ID, order date, customer name, state, and the city. So this is how you merge two queries into one. Mm -hmm. I shall make this file available in a Google Drive link where you can download in the description section. And if you like this video, make sure to like and also comment if you have any question from this video feel free to drop it in the comment section i shall reply to it immediately and if you haven't uh, subscribed to the youtube channel feel free to hit the subscribe button and also turn on the notification button because we shall be dropping very interesting section and videos of this power pi series thank you for watching stay blessed